I'm Andy McClellan from Quantitative Research and Development at Numerix. I'll be discussing MVA, the Margin Valuation Adjustment, which is about capturing the cost of funding, the initial margin we're required to post for a given derivative portfolio. It's a topic which has been increasing in interest among our clients the past few years, largely because initial margin requirements themselves have been increasing the past few years as the current regulatory regime rolls out. I'll also discuss some important conceptual issues within MBA. For example, hedge side initial margin requirements. We tend to think about MBA in terms of a given portfolio, often a client portfolio. In a practical trading setting, however, it's important to think also about the initial margin requirements for that portfolio's hedges. A simple example might be that we have an exotic interest rate derivative with a client hedged by vanilla European swaptions and swaps with other banking counterparties. It's important to capture the cost of funding that initial margin as well in a total MBA for this portfolio. So I'll be discussing how to forecast those hedging positions which may be dynamic, how to convert those hedging positions into initial margin requirements and how to capture the total MBA within a single figure. I'll also touch upon some of the more nuanced, probably more controversial aspects of when how much of that hedge side initial margin should be reflected in this client